Hi friends, it is Mary from Mom Behind the Computer. Today is um, the Saturday before Thanksgiving and um, we are actually going to go ahead and at least get up our Christmas tree today. Um, as 2020 is, we decided to do it a little early this year for us. Um, so we are working on doing that. Um, we've kind of had a lazy day, haven't we, for the most part. <laughs> um, just trying to take care of some things around the house. But we wanted to go ahead and at least get our trees up and what we can of our decorations. Um, we're doing a little less decorations this year because um, our little six month old, we don't want to overcomplicate things. You know, it's going to be hard enough having him uh, fighting to get to the tree. So we want to be able to enjoy it as much as possible without having to tell him no too much and things like that. But we want to be able to enjoy our decorations as well. So that's what we're getting ready to do. Um, it's late in the day, but I'm going to do a little girl's hair. And then uh, Daddy's prepping things for us as a champ here. Um, little guy's playing and we are going to get to decorating. Yay! the tree is now decorated except for one of the most important parts baby Jesus on top and we've got a very special helper who is a pro at this right uh-huh yep So here's a little tour of our Christmas decorations that we set out this year. We didn't do nearly as much. Honestly, I'm, I'm just, I would love to have a Christmas wonderland, but I'm just not filling up to it right now. We may put more out later. Um, but anyway, so this is our um, Christmas card holder, and I'm really hoping we get some good Christmas cards um to stick in there that's one of my favorite parts of christmas a lot of our decorated area just because a little guy is so little um so under daddy's arcade is um some of our nutcrackers and our snowmen and those are our family snowmen that i made when little girl was little and i need to make another one for my little guy so i'm hoping i'll have time to do that this year over here is a little mailbox that my mom um, before she passed away she got that for my little girl and my dad passed it on to us um so we are uh, we use that sometimes as a little mailbox. Snow globe I found. I just love snow globes. Can you angle it a little so they can see the picture inside? And I was able to put a really fun picture of a little girl when she was eating snow. <laughs> and then the other side is uh, her Christmas picture from last year, which had snow in it as well. And I just love those. I need to find another one for my little guy this year. I'm hoping maybe I can order one online because I didn't even, I don't know why I didn't buy one last year. I have year. some birthday stuff out, but this is my Miriam Bright sign that actually lights up that I love. And this is um, a little photo frame that I put some wrapping paper in. It went with our baking area last year, but I'm not going to have that out this year because we just have too much baby stuff out. So you can just sit it down, please. So um, I'm going to stick it up down here because I just think it's... Here is um, some stuff I made, actually. Um, so last year I followed some tutorials online and I got um, canvases and tore them off and stained with... Dollars, these are dollar store canvases. I stained them with dollar store paint and a little water and I think they turned out so pretty and then I printed 
these sayings from a site. I don't remember which one or else I would link it. Um, and I just, I love how they turned out. They're so pretty. And then I made this little uh, battery operated candle several years ago. Um, and I just love it. Um, that was one of my sayings one year that I loved was merry and bright. I still love it, but um, I have ones that sort of resonate to me each year. And that was one of those. Two of my favorite parts. Um, this is our little trunk and it closes up almost completely. There's a couple books I have to pull out, but um, we keep Christmas books in there. And then every year we kind of go through those. And uh, I just love the different Christmas books we have. Some of them were given to us, some of them mommy bought, <laughs> um, but they're always a lot of fun. I'm sure little girl's gonna be out aging them soon, but thankfully we have a little, little guy and uh, I think she'll enjoy sharing those with her, with him, sorry. Um, and then this is my bucket of snowballs. These are all yarn, uh, pom poms that uh, we use for snowball fights every year. And I just love this. I made this um, as a gift for some friends also. And uh, I just love that. Little girl, we were never train people, um, me and my husband, but little girl wanted a train last year and she actually bought it with her own money. So now we have a train that goes around. Um, I have a couple of boxes that I got from Hobby Lobby and a little house thing. And honestly, um, we do not do a ton of gifts anymore. We do some for our kids and friends kids but um, we don't do nearly the amount we used to so honestly I usually just keep these types of things for decorations under the tree and then um, get them get the presents out later and throw them under there so um, and then we have the tree I'm sitting here on the ground with little guy um, we have a lot of fun ornaments um, a lot of them are sentimental and memory things, which mean a ton to me. There are also some really fun ones. This was one I had as a kid. Um, that's one of my favorites that Pookie is on behind him. And if I didn't have a little guy in my arms, I'd show you. Um, and Hoops and Yo-Yo, I love. Um, I love all of the sentimental ones, but there are just a few that are just so much fun. I showed you a couple of little girl when she was a, a baby and things like that. Um, and I gotta get some for my little guy. Uh, so I'm very happy. Our tree is not one of those like, themed trees or anything like that we just do a lot of family ones that mean a lot to us and um i think that for me that's the type of um tree that just means the most to me so um, i'm so happy to have some that remind me of my childhood um and then our early marriage we haven't gotten any i don't think we've gotten any from hubby's uh childhood um, I assume eventually, maybe one day we'll get those, but um, <laughs> we have a lot from our early marriage and from little girl, and uh, we just keep adding more memories to it every year. Are the Christmas decorations we have out so far? I imagine that eventually we'll probably put out a few more, um, but it's going to be nowhere like we did last year or um, other years. <laughs> other years, just because um, this little guy is sort of like doing a belly crawl thing, and he just wants to grab everything, and it makes him mad when he doesn't get to. And it makes me sad when I have to tell him no. And so um, I just kind of wanted to keep things as centralized as possible um, in order to just kind of do our thing. So that is what we're doing so far this year. We'll probably add some more in. And if we do, I'll probably show you. Um, but for right now, it's true, not a teething necklace. Uh, for right now, that's where we're at. We are getting ready. Um, they're upstairs making some popcorn. I think we're going to watch the original Grinch cartoon, the short one that's shown on TV a lot, um, to end out our night. So um, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you have a blessed day. If you want to see more holiday adventures with us, please be sure to hit the subscribe button. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope you have a blessed day. Bye-bye.